that man is not in the middle of some extreme sport. He's in fact collecting tree data from Peru in a bid to prevent deforestation around the world. How? He's part of a global team with this non-profit that tracks deforested goods using tree data. Here's how it works. Trees and plants in different locations have different chemical and genetic properties. This tree in Australia will have a different ratio of chemicals than a tree of the same species in Brazil. That ratio differs even for trees from two locations in the same city. Now with this science in mind, WFID creates databases with the samples they collect, which tell us what a tree from any location would look like, chemically and genetically speaking. But why is this important now? The EUDR. This new law, slated to go into effect in 2025, requires companies to ensure that their products are deforestation free. Let's say we want to find out where the wood that made this chair came from. WFID will extract data from the wood in this chair and then check it against their database. And voila, we'll know if the actual source matches up against where the chair's producer says it comes from. WFID is now working to expand their database to include other EUDR commodities like soybean, cocoa and coffee, hopefully contributing to the global quest to save our planet.